Hey guys, so happy Halloween. I got some interesting stuff scheduled for today. I'm gonna go to this place and hunt for books. Their books are like $3 each. Like buy three, get one free or something, but they have a bunch of long boxes. So I'm gonna go hunt for some keys in there and see what happens. See if I can make them give me a deal. Uh, uh, I won't buy it unless it's good enough to buy. And uh, I got a bunch of other plans today, so I will be back. But uh, get ready. And please subscribe. Thanks, bye. Holy crap, guys. I, oh my God. I wish I could have filmed, but they play music in there, so it would have banned me the, the video. I'm gonna show you something really fast. I, dude, I cannot believe I found this book right here. I, Dude, you guys have no idea what this is. I'm gonna, probably not, let me show you. Dude, it's cyber fog number zero, dude. I have a couple other issues that I found. This is this guy had no idea what it is. Cyber fog number zero, and it's the uh, ash can, dude. This is so rare, and right now it's fire. I can't wait to get home and unload all this stuff and show you guys. Um, dude, look at this. Cyber fog number four. Oh my god, dude. There's all types. Omega men. There's all types of stuff in here. But this, I think, is the grab of the day. Oh, my God. So, uh, I'll keep going. Hey, guys. Welcome back to Economics and Comics. So, I went out. It's Happy Halloween, by the way. I went out. I got a big box from Midtown, okay, first of all. So, I'm going to show you those books first. But I went out to this place that had, like, $3 books. Not dollar books, but it was, like, buy three, get one free. So, I just dug for a while. Now, I did find some good things, and I find some normal things, but, you know, well, key. Um, some of the stuff wasn't key, it was just in the bag with the other thing. But I did find some interesting things, and I want to show you. So, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you like the video after a while, throw a like. It's easy to do. Um, also, if you go to other videos today, other comic videos, I want you to put in there, save economics and comics live stream and i want you to push and push i want to spread it all over the place until youtube listens okay here we go so new books real quick new books that i just got in i got the uh art the uh art germ variants for spider-man ghost Rider, ghost spider i got two of them pretty happy about that i also got Two of the Battle Lines ones. Boom, boom, boom. They're both sick. I got the David Finch Moon Knight number 200 variant. I'm excited about that one as well. These are all the extras I got ordered in advance a little bit. You know, so I got two of the uh, Batgirl 28 Middleton variants. Because I love Middleton. I got two of those. This is all in a box today. Um, Amazing Spider-Man number eight. I got the cover C variant. Um, none of the stores had them, but I got two of them. And of course, my favorite cover from that week was the Green Goblin Battle Line variant. Love those. And a bunch more Thor number sixes. So, let's get out that out of the way. Let me put these somewhere. Okay, so that's that. Also, if you're interested in information early and stuff that you don't see on this channel, check out my Patreon page. You can always go to my homepage. There's playlist videos, there's an about portion. You can click on about. You can click on the business inquiries, that's my email, or any of the links there that I have at any one of my things. So check that out. Now, as I said, for Halloween, I went look uh, digging a little bit. And you saw that earlier, some of the stuff I showed you So in the early video. So here we go. This is what I got. It's kind of interesting mix of things, okay? So 
Nothing super old. There's a couple things in there that are interesting, but here we go. So first I got Warlock and the Infinity Watch, and it's a first appearance of the uh, Infinity Watch team appearance, and what they do is they split up all the stones. So this is key, okay? And it's very possible this book, this stuff could happen in the movie. Because they did show Warlock in Guardians of the Galaxy 2. He was still in his little cocoon. And in the comic books, you know that after this whole thing, they split up the, book, the gems and everything, and everyone watches one designation. This is key. This takes place right after the Infinity, Infinity Gauntlet run. Okay? So maybe look for that one. I was pretty happy I found it. Omega the Unknown, number one. I found it. It's okay condition, but it is the first appearance of Omega the Unknown, so I was pretty happy to get that too. Now this, I think this is my biggest one today, and if you don't know a lot about it, I'm going to tell you. So, Cyber Frog number zero. This is the ash can. These are hard to find. So Ethan Van Skyver, who's I've met, I mean, I know there's a lot of different controversy between uh, this whole move, the two movements in the comic world. I listen to everybody. I'm a middle guy. I take no real stand. Uh, but I like Ethan Van Skyver a lot. I've met him a couple times. He's done art for me. He's a really nice guy. So he left DC Comics, okay? He created a Patreon and said, I'm gonna, I'm tired of this. I am gonna do Cyberfrog. I'm gonna bring Cyberfrog back. So he did this Patreon and he got like a half a million dollars in donations. It's unbelievable. Well, not donations, they'll get stuff. But he's currently on his videos drawing them and talking about it and stuff like that. And they help local artists and stuff like that, help with their patrons. I need to talk to him a little bit about that. But this is the ash can preview for the very first one in the origin of Cyberfog, I believe. And I can't believe it was in there. Um, when that other book comes out, this is going to be fire hot. And I got it. I'm so excited. I also got Cyberfog number four was in there. The older one. And the art inside is incredible, guys. I also got Cyber Frog the Reservoir Dog. Or Reservoir Frog number one. Guess what? This book is rare, super scarce, and I found it. I can't believe it. I look up, look it up. It is super rare, man, and I cannot believe I found it. Wow. When that new book, when he's finally done with that book, dude, those are going to explode. Oh god, I'm so happy about that. So, next, <laughs> Marvel Holiday Special number 1. So, yo, that's dumb, whatever. Okay, well, it's the uh, first appearance. Well, not the first appearance. It's like a uh, origin of Santa Claus. And apparently, he's one of the most strongest super hearing humans. Santa Claus. All right, let me take a, a sip of my drink to that because it's Halloween and we're almost at Christmas. I'm so excited for tonight. I got this thing I'm going to try to do. Let's see if it works. I'm going to give them a chance. Candy or comic. We'll see what they do. Either way, I'm going to give them a comic because it's all about comics. Okay. Here we go. So, Uncanny X-Men. Oh, it, it doesn't have... It looks like it's gra glare, but there's not. Uncanny X-Men number 317. First appearance of Blink, which is cool. Now, remember this. There's no holograph thing here. So, let me check something really quick because... I'm curious. Well, it says direct edition. It is a newsstand cover. But it's the first appearance of Blink, which is really cool. I, I really did good today, I think. I really did good. Okay. Spawn, number 12. Origin. Okay. It's There's a flashback of, Frank, of uh, Spawn dying. There's an origin of Spawn in this. And the first and first Jason win. So this is a key spawn book. And everyone loves that cover number 12. I found it. <laughs> uh, this was just in the bundle. X-Men 299. It was in behind one of the ones that I bought. And again, unbelievably, 
Uncanny X-Men number 300. I keep getting these books, and these are always in good condition. It's really funny. So, excuse me, this is the first appearance of the Legacy Virus. I'll keep buying them if they're cheap. Okay, so, let me see here. Okay, so, I got some X-Factor, too. So, I got X-Factor number 37. Now, when I was a younger, I read these Infernos. I loved this run of Infernos. It crossed over with everything. It's really cool. A man and woman prior. So, I got number 37. And then I got number 38, which is the death of Man and Pryor. Uh, yeah, that's right. Number 38. And the whole Phoenix storyline and all that. Uh, we'll see. But it's a giant size. I love that Inferno run. And that's cool. I also got X Factor number 25, which is the second appearance of Archangel. Okay. Now, what else do we got here? Now, this is cool. I found an Iron Man number 109, and it's the first appearance of uh, Vanguard and, you know, some other things. But it's a key book, man. I found it. And it's not too bad of a shape. So, these are all key. Well, almost all of them are key. Um... Regardless, so Harley Quinn number one rebirth. It was in the bin. I'm like, okay, I'll buy it. You, if it was, Harley Quinn number one's in there, near mint condition, all day, all day. So this is the first Uncanny X-Men 316, first Monet Croy, or I can't exactly know what it said, but you see here the little reflective right number 316. So I'll get back to that in a second. Because I already got one blink, and that's number 317. So I also got New Mutants number 95, and that's the Death of Warlock. There you go. Pretty cool. Number 270 was just in a... It's part of the Extinction Agenda. Actually, it's part one of it, which is cool. It was just in with another book, so... I, you know, I, Another thing, guys, here's a tip. When you go diving, I'm sure you all do this, okay? When you go diving, you get dirty. Your hands get dirty on all the bags and all the garbage and, the, you know, there's dirt because they're probably in garages or whatever. Make sure once you get home, this is what I do. When I get home, I grade the book. I immediately grade, I pull it out, I grade it, and I rebag it. Done, then I'm done. And it's an estimate grade. It's, you know, I might look at it better next time. But just for me, I put it on there and get it done with. Anyway, my advice, get home, rebag them, get rid of that garbage bags. So this is the first team appearance of Generation X, guys. It's uh, Uncanny X-Men number 318. I was there, picked it up. Now, back to Blink. Got another one. This one's different, though. It's got the little shiny doodads. So... I got two first appearances of Blink. Pretty excited about that. I can't remember what was key about this book, but, uh, you know, it was hot for some reason recently. Uh, it was there, so I got it. 401 was with it. Incredible Hulk. Okay. Then I got... The first Blackheart Daredevil number 270. I, I had thousands of these, but now it's like, what am I doing? I got rid of them also. First appearance of Blackheart. That's cool. Daredevil 270. And it had 271 in there too. I like that cover. So whatever. It was in one bag. Last but not least for today, I got an X-Force number two in there. And that's the second appearance of Deadpool. So, I would say out of these... I'm going to give you my best. Well, I really like Blink. It's not worth that much. Oh, I don't know. Let's see. I'm just going to give you my, my exciting ones to me. Just kind of like going over them. What do we got here? Oh, it's okay. Hang on. Bear with me, guys. Don't leave me now. Okay. Now, yeah, I went through a lot, guys, and there's some here and there. 
But these are my favorite. I mean, they're all good, but these are my favorites. So, the Omega Man number one. That's the first appearance of the Omega Man. The Unknown. Omega the Unknown. Warlock, the Infinity Watch. Number one. Cool, dude. Sick cover. Right? He's got the, the Infinity Gauntlet. It's the, everything about that. The Spawn number 12, Origin, and all that goodies. The X Factor number 25, Second Archangel. Uh... The uh, Iron Man, first Crimson Dynamo, first Vanguard, Iron Man 109. This is 95, Death of Warlock. Uh, first Generation X team up. And I had two blinks, here's one of them. Got the second appearance of Deadpool. I got a Cyber Fog number one, the Scarce book. Scarce, and of course, even scarcer. Cyber Frog Zero Ash Can. Okay, guys, I spent about forty dollars on all this. Forty dollars, and I know one of them is a little more than that. So I think that's a good pickup right there. Bunch of keys, couple extras. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, we are the Jedi, GI Jedi, dude. I need you guys' help. Let's go. Video comes out. Comment on it. Oh, what the hell save economics and comics live streaming? Well, it means they got he got screwed And for no reason blah 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 Dude, I'm fighting the power till it happens. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Happy Halloween guys. See ya